Lads, lads, lads. Let's hear it for the lads. The dads who feel a little bit tender after they've been on a bender. The lads who finally surrender and say, Bit rough, me lad. Let's hear it for the lads, the brads who it rather for a manic week at work, who peg it to the pub for a cheeky chat and a flirt and to dish the dirt on the lads. Lads, lads, lads. Let's hear it for the lads. But not the kind of lads who feel sad or mad or the ones who are struggling with the prospect of becoming a dad. Lads, lads, lads. Let's hear it for the lads. But not when we lose all that we had or when our cuts and our bruises don't form into scabs, when we demand, I'm all right, me, lad. Honest. Because we ain't broken anything. Not an arm or a leg, so we don't beg or ask for help. But instead, we fight against the mind and all of its voices, a mind that reduces and relishes in the thought of doubt, that spouts out and hits us like spikes, a mind that's been stabbed and jabbed, but it's us lads that put up and shut up, petrified that someone might blab. That wouldn't be too fab. Let's hear it for the lads. But only cheer us on when our behaviour is lad-ish. When we're out at night having a peroni but feeling lonely. But on the outside, we're cheering at the sides of England, scoring a goal. We're on a roll of pretending. But don't cheer us on when we're falling into the darkest of holes, because that doesn't fit into society's moulds of what being a lad should be. Talk, but don't talk too much. Because they only want to see the banter, the testosterone, the lads in the gym and the lads who fit in. The men, the man who will and can lift you, carry you and throw you around. It's sexy when you take control. We like a man who takes charge, who barges through the crowd, who sticks up for us in town. A lad who isn't like all the other clowns. But don't tell him it's a mask. A facade, a bravado to cover what you'll finally discover to be a broken mind and we don't get another. And no one can help or fix it today. Cos you're not sick or poorly, lad. Come on, lad, you'll find your way. But what I want to say is not today. Today, I can't lift you up or take you to town. Cos who's lifting us when our minds slowly drown? What about the lads who don't talk in the pub but who happily shove their issues into the back of their mind where they fester and build into words not so kind? And what about the lads who can't open up isn't it your job to ask us what's really up? Lend us an ear, or a shoulder to lean on so there's no brushing it off or brushing it under, cos I'm still a lad, whether the mind is sunshine or thunder. 84 men a week take their own life. 75% of all suicides in the UK are reported as being male. Despite you saying we are here to listen, whilst in the same breath you whisper, Man, Man up. up. Man up into what? A lad. A, a lad's lad, a generation from our granddads who never spoke up, open up. Don't man up. And maybe ask that lad that you know what's really up. <laughs>